Question six, yet another question on our functions, but this time it's including an exponential function. In the description box, we will my links for other videos on our recording for this question paper, ga 2016 November. Now, the graph of g is equal to minus two exponent x plus eight is gauge below a and b are the y and x intercepts respectively of G. So this is an exponential function, right? Uh, but equation, but but sketch as well. So we have to answer our questions along the line. Now, log six point one. But you write down the range of G. So log six point one. The range of G. A range is the set of our y values are valid for the graph, right? So we graph here to now talk back, I call a log asymptote and then it goes all the way down, right? All the way down. The error is good, it continues to negative bunny infinity. It continues to negative infinity. So our range is over is a range of from I saw the range Nasi Pala City element of um minimum value to maximum value. He liked it color corner, he liked inner corner, the minimum and the maximum. So it's negative infinity to y equal to the asymptote of this, the, the horizontal asymptote. E exponential function has a horizontal asymptote and the horizontal asymptote it's always this value which is equal to 8. y is equal to 8. So therefore our range it's y element of minus infinity to positive 8. Okay, 6.2. Determine the coordinates of B. O B obvious as well as A obvious. Now, eh? This is the y intercept. And then this is the x intercept. Yes. So in other words, we have to find the, the x intercept of this equation or of this graph which is our coordinates got b so 6.2 um see for now the x intercept where we let y to be to, to be equal to zero so now which of x no faguban is zero so it's going to be zero equal to minus two raised to exponent x plus eight and then we solve for x this is an exponential equation so we transpose low minus a to the left hand side and then in your solver for x, but first let's divide both sides by minus one so that we remove lama negative signs lower and then in salano eight equal to two raised to exponent x. Now this eight is a non-prime number. So Gomelesi Pale is a power with a prime number base, which is going to be two raised to exponent bani three, so that to see Zobanani nale one to one ratio so that we drop our exponent. So after dropping our exponents, we get a 3 equal to x. So the coordinates for b, it's 3 and 0. This is the x intercept for graph g. Now, say so 6.3, 6.3, but if g is reflected over the x axis to form a new graph h, determine the equation of h. Okay. All right, all right, all right. So this is the x-axis. Now x-axis here to learn. You begin to learn how to combine this reflection of a kulumang So what is the graph G? Now G is reflected over the x-axis to form a new graph H. Now okay, we are reflecting the graph Gabani G to obtain U H again, much. So. Lana, we get this one again. This equation h now h, and then let's say the axis here is straight. Hala, yeah, one. And then um, check out something. U a manje na ula, and then u b I change. Uyo salala agupi lasim tole kona kona uzo salala, right? This is the reflection of ubani. H, but it's one of the equation about to see draw the sketch. So the equation you're now so you told on John again. Mouta talk back. What happens if a reflection is taking place over the x axis? 
the y values of g they were once positive but now reflect uh, over the x-axis the y values change abanjani about negative so in other words it means that with 6.3 the graph k h of x is equal to minus g of x in other words you multiply with g of x by a negative sign so therefore nang tata with g multiply by a negative sign lo po lo lo 2 raised to exponent x you have a positive lo 8 have a negative so our answer la is 2 raised to exponent x minus 8 so 6.4 but explain why the x intercept of g and h are both at b uh, okay they are both at b moreover because g was reflected about the x-axis so that's why b and a shift and another reason is that y for this coordinate the y value for this coordinate x the y coordinate is zero for both therefore o y over zero for both and the o y over zero for both ulogai u g no h it means the same value of x will be obtained for g no h so that's why um, the x intercepts for g no h are both the same so question six lana it was a short one um, i hope you enjoy it and if you did you can support show your support by liking sharing subscribing and starting a conversation in the comment section let us just discuss um any questions or now or any any other question or or, or, or now or, or relevant to this question paper or any other question paper for that matter so now we we enjoy it please don't cross look share on a bang and back as well so for now thanks for tuning in thanks for watching us one on in the next video which i told as well as in the in the description box of this video so for now bye bye